to make a perfect pie crust or <clears throat> maybe even a banana bread. We'll tell you all about that. Not before we meet Jessica Hart. Welcome Hi, back, David. friend. Mwah. Good to see you. Good to see you. Uh, this looks familiar to me. Yes, so, so often you are trying to break apart your meat with a fork. It's time consuming. And how's that splatter and grease working out you on know, your hand? It's not, it's not great, and it's not great for your silverware either. So let me show you what OXO has done to make this a much easier process. You can break apart your ground beef with our ground meat chopper. We've got these three wide blades here and a rounded edge design so you can turn, which will help brown the meat evenly. You can control the consistency, so if you like it you know, chopped really finely, you can do it, or you can have the big chunks as well, whatever you like for your food, um, you know, for your tacos or for your chili. We're well, I mean, think about it. Here. So many recipes call for um, crumble and brown a, a pound of ground beef, mm -hmm. or ground sausage, or ground turkey, or ground chicken. Maybe you're making meatballs. That's Maybe you're right. going to be making all kinds of different things, and you need, maybe or to your point, tacos, um, the filling for tacos. Yes. Maybe you're going to be making some of those different helpers, oh, you know, yeah, in the kitchen. Too. You those, know what I'm talking are about. Quick and easy. So, mm -hmm. Yeah. So it's all about having the right tool. Now, you might be thinking that's a great price to pay for that one tool, but guess what? That's not all you're getting. Mm -mm. You're not only going to get what we call the the meat chopper. But you're also getting the slotted spoon, both from OXO. You go into your kitchen supply store and you see OXO from floor to ceiling on the peg wall, yep, right? Yep. It looks just like that in their showroom in New York, too, <laughs> sure when does. I've been there and helped to select product. It's yep. an amazing place. It's a, it's a place where form meets function, where function meets uh, everyday problem solving. Yes, exactly. And I love it. Um, this is just an extraordinary company. And these are both dishwasher safe top rack. They are. Throw them in there quick and easy. But look at how quickly Jess has been able yep. to uniformly break up that ground meat. There you go. As it's browning, because remember, this is a very thick nylon, and then the edge here is silicone, which is great for scraping, also kind of folding the meat yes. back into itself. We've got that red silicone edge that helps you kind of stir everything up in there. You can get the edges of the pan, and then you can even use this to stir, but we've got the nylon slotted spoon that we were talking about. Which makes it even easier. Yes, both of these are heat resistant to 400 degrees. They are made of nylon, and you can use this for stirring. You can use this for draining your meat, should you have one, you know, that's 80%. Um, or put it in a bowl of beans that's been cooked in liquid, and you want to be able to strain those that, out. That's true, too. Really simple. So now, what if I want to so fold easy. maybe seasoning into ground turkey like you've yes. got here? So we've got the ground turkey. We can have... have the taco seasoning on the top there. And we've got that good grip handle from OXO that we've all come to know and love. That's mm, what they're famous for. Such a neat And you can item. get a nice, le you can get your leverage on top of the pan here. Instead of having the fork and pressing, you can stir. Oh, I smell that delicious oh, taco seasoning too. You can too. smell it mixing it in there. It smells nicely with ground so turkey. So you've got something that's really great for your family. So I much I do want to easier. let you know, this price is extraordinary. For $14 and change, you're getting both tools. You're going to get this ground meat chopper, and the slotted spoon, all for less than $15. This is an amazing buy. What you don't want to do is wait because we've already taken orders for 500 are now oh, gone. Right, wonderful. So we've got ground beef. Ground beef. We've done, I'll keep working on your ground turkey. Ground there. turkey, yeah. We you also don't mind. have we some also ground have sausage. The ground sausage. We had heard from the customers um, saying that they love to use this for ground sausage too. So we wanted to show that to you tonight. Um, so we've got ground sausage patties here, and you just break them apart. You think about getting in there with the fork like you used to, and how difficult it was. How much easier this is with a little bit of leverage from that good grips handle from above. A little you scrape can put your, with the silicone. Put your thumb on top to get that going, and then you can scrape on the sides with that red silicone handle. Let me break this patty apart a little bit more. Yeah, and I there. like your style too, David, to spin it a little faster there. I like, well, you know, I'm always in a hurry in the kitchen. <laughs> so look at this. This is, you know, when you cook on TV, you don't do anything slowly. Yeah, <laughs> you, right. everything's in a hurry, right? There you go. It's like it's a contest. <laughs> uh, but look at this. Don't be afraid to get in there and bounce up and down a little bit. Right. You're not going to hurt your nonstick pans with this. this no, is nylon that's, it's and silicone. Yep, it's nylon and it's nonstick safe. You can use it for your, um, your stainless, for your nonstick, and top rack dishwasher safe. So you just throw it in the top because you can do um, ground meats like we're doing, ground sausage, but you you can also do some of the savory uh, sweets down below in, on top of the savories. Ooh, now we've shown meat. I think we've really kind of made this part of it clear. Yes. Let's come down and show a few other ways to use this. And I love these ideas. Oh, it's just so much fun. We've I got did about a, a minute left. Yes. So let's, well, let's bust through these. Okay, so I did a peach cobbler the other day, which I was telling you about, which was so much fun to fold in the butter that we were talking about and Into cut, cut, cut in the butter. Topping, yeah. But you can also do banana bread, which I love to do. My daughter Zara is a huge banana bread fan. Is that right? And again, you know, I usually freeze my bananas 
when they're starting to get um, brown, and I take them out, I thaw them, and then again I stand there with a fork pushing every little piece of it down. You've got this ground meat chopper that you can use now. It's so versatile in your kitchen to Ooh, use these for are going banana quickly. bread. 800 now oh, gone, wonderful. sweetie. Yeah, That's so great. 800 gone. We've mashed up the banana for yep. banana bread. Yep. What if I'm mixing together meatloaf? So if you like to do that for meatloaf too. Some people like to get their hands in there, get it mixed around. Some people like to get dirty. Uh, others do not. So it's really a nice you know way I, to I mix mean, I don't, everything. I'm not shy in there. about putting my hands in it, Jess. Yeah. But what I don't want to do with meatloaf or meatballs is overwork the meat. Yeah. That's because true. if you overwork the mixture, you're going to make for tough meatloaf or tough meatballs. Yes. So, so this may help you do that without overworking the mixture. Too yes, much. there you go. So it's just there's so many uses for this in the kitchen. Mm. I don't want to use that fork anymore. I want to use something that was created to make it a lot easier and a lot more fun. Well, don't miss out on this. We're very, very busy. In fact, now we've taken orders for a thousand sets oh, are that's gone. Wonderful. We have the ground meat chopper as well as the slotted mm -hmm. spoon from our friends and buddies at OXO. Mm -hmm. Don't miss out on this. Very, very busy and very, very popular. Thank you, my Thank darling. Thank you, David. Mwah. And give both those babies <laughs> I will. a kiss from Uncle David. I will. All right. Thanks, Fantastic. David. Fantastic. All right, let's go over here and continue our zucchini cheddar waffles with bacon butter. Now, off the top, no bacon butter. I can hardly.